What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Turkey Chan. Today, I'm doing a comparison review of two popular Lululemon shorts. First one, we have the Lululemon Pace Breaker. And next, we have the Lululemon Bowline. Now, these shorts both come in black. And these two are my two favorite shorts. I wear them all throughout summer, and I rotate between these two models. Personally, I don't mind having both of them in my collection. It lets me swap in and out based on the features that each one of them have. So for the bowline short, it is three pockets. All the pockets are zippered. So you have two side pockets, one back pocket, all zippered. Pockets are quite large. You can fit your whole phone and then some. You can even fit a whole bottle of water. It's truly large. Inside these pockets, there are no inner pockets. So if you have keys or anything like that, they're gonna move around in this pocket quite a lot. Same thing for the back pocket. Very, very spacious. You could fit a big old wallet in here and have no problem. The waistband out is also very sturdy. It's easy to tie and untie. Now these drawstrings are a thinner drawstring so tying them too tight can require some time to unknot these so watch out for that these are made out of this woven material not the, not the most comfortable material when compared to the pace breaker can be a bit scratchy can be a bit hot but overall nothing too noticeable to make me put these down they're still highly highly wearable for the summer Another thing is the leg opening is very, very spacious. Even though you hike them up, where are these shorts hiked up, there's so much space in this leg opening. So you'll get a lot of airflow, a lot of comfort, a lot of space for your junk. But these shorts, you can wear them to the gym, no problem. They're abrasion resistant material, great breathability. Definitely you can wear it to the gym and then go on a date right after. So these look great. Next we have the pace breaker. This one, lighter material, more flowy material. This one is perfect for those really hot days. Perfect for that intense gym workout. Zippered side pocket. I love this zipper side pocket. You can put your wallet, your keys, and whatnot in there and not have it interrupt you when you sit down. Regular slip pockets. I wish these were zippered, but they're not, unfortunately. But they do have inner pockets, so perfect for holding holding your phone, your cards, and your keys. Now this one, it does have thicker drawstrings, so it's easier to tie and untie. Waistband isn't as thick as the bowline short, but it still can keep you very secure, keep everything secure. Extremely, extremely breathable shorts. I never had any issues with the shorts when working out. And the fit, it is a bit more slim than the bowline short, but still very stretchy and comfortable to wear this one this short um, one of my all-time favorites this is the first short i bought from lululemon and the build quality is very nice and it's lasted me two summers so far and there's no color fading so yeah this short i wear exclusively for the gym so if it, if, if you're deciding between to get the bowline or to get the pace breaker the simplest way I could put it is, if you're more active, definitely get the pace breaker for the ventilation and the comfort of the short. But if you're more active and you need more security, zippered pockets and whatnot, go ahead and get the bowline. You can work out with this just as well. Now, if you're more casual, you like to wear button-ups, polos, then I would stay away from the pace breaker. It's a bit too sporty. Look at all these sporty lines running through it. Uh, to, to pair it with like a button up or a polo, definitely go with the bow line. It looks like a regular pair of shorts. So this will work more with those business casual outfits. But yeah, that's all I have guys. Ciao.